Have you ever heard of a tourist who accidentally ended up in Belarus while trying to get to Belgium? Talk about a geographical blunder. But as they say, sometimes the wrong train takes you to the right station. And boy, was it the right station. Welcome, dear wanderers, to the heart of Eastern Europe, the land of pristine landscapes and vibrant history, Belarus. Imagine a place that has managed to keep its rustic charm intact, with verdant forests and serene lakes, painting a picture of tranquility, a place where time seems to have slowed down just to let you savor the moment. That's Belarus for you. Situated in the eastern part of Europe, Belarus is often overlooked by travelers who are drawn to the more popular tourist destinations. But those who venture off the beaten path are rewarded with a cultural extravaganza and natural beauty that is uniquely Belarusian. This landlocked country is the epitome of Eastern European charm, a fascinating blend of the old and the new, where medieval castles coexist with modern cities, where tradition meets innovation, and where history and culture are intertwined with the fabric of everyday life. Belarus is not just a destination, it's a journey, a journey that takes you across picturesque landscapes, through centuries-old traditions, and into the heart of a warm and welcoming culture. From the bustling city life of Minsk, the capital city that never sleeps, to the tranquil countryside where life moves at a slower pace, Belarus promises an experience unlike any other. Whether you're a history buff, a nature enthusiast, or a food lover, Belarus has something for everyone. And the best part? It's still relatively undiscovered by the masses, giving you the chance to explore this hidden gem without the usual tourist crowds. So, if you're ready to embark on an epic adventure, buckle up. And while you're at it, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. And we're curious, which part of Belarus are you most excited to explore? Let us know in the comments below. Belarusian architecture is like a time capsule. You might not get a DeLorean, but it's the closest you'll get to time travel. Belarus is a treasure trove of architectural wonders that tell tales of different epochs. Imagine this. Medieval castles like the Grand Mir Castle, standing tall and proud amidst the modern cityscape, whispering stories of knights and nobility. Then there's the Nesvish Castle, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, a Renaissance masterpiece that's a testament to the nation's rich cultural heritage. But it's not all about the past. The Soviet-era buildings, with their imposing brutalist style, offer a stark contrast, reflecting a different period in Belarusian history. These structures, often overlooked, hold a charm of their own, embodying the resilience and spirit of the Belarusian people. Be it the grandeur of the castles or the simplicity of the Soviet buildings, every brick and stone in Belarus has a story to share. It's like stepping into a history book, only better, because there are no pop quizzes. If concrete jungles aren't your thing, Belarus has got you covered with actual jungles. Well, forests to be precise. This Eastern European gem is a paradise for nature lovers, boasting an impressive array of green spaces that are often referred to as the green lungs of Belarus. Imagine yourself wandering through the dense canopy of Belovechskaya Pushcha National Park, one of the largest and oldest forests in Europe. This UNESCO World Heritage Site is a testament to the country's commitment to preserving its natural beauty. It's not just a forest, but a thriving ecosystem that's home to the majestic European bison, a creature that has roamed these lands for centuries. From the lush greenery of the summer to the snow-capped trees of the winter, Every season brings a new layer of beauty to these forests. So whether you're an adventure seeker or a peace lover, the green lungs of Belarus offer a perfect escape from the hustle and bustle of city life. Remember, the best kind of therapy is nature therapy. Belarusians may seem reserved at first, but don't let that fool you. They're like a good book. The more you read, the better it gets. Let's delve into the heart of Belarus, a place where people are the real treasure. The Belarusian people are known for their warm hospitality, a trait that is deeply rooted in their culture. You'll be greeted with open arms and treated like family, even if you're a stranger. The Belarusians' open-heartedness is a testament to their belief that every guest brings joy and happiness into their homes. Belarus is also a melting pot of rich traditions that date back centuries. These traditions, from folk dances to music, are not just relics of the past, but are very much alive and part of their daily lives. 
Take the Kupale Festival, for instance, which is a midsummer night celebration filled with music, dancing, and the search for a mythical fern flower. It's an enchanting experience that you wouldn't want to miss. Speaking of enchanting, have you ever heard of the Belarusian language? It's a beautiful Slavic language that sings to the ears. While Russian is widely spoken, the Belarusian language is cherished as a symbol of national identity. There's a saying in Belarus, language is the soul of the nation. And indeed it is. Beyond language and traditions, the Belarusian people are also known for their resilience and tenacity. Throughout history, they faced numerous challenges, but have always emerged stronger. This resilience is not just a characteristic, it's a way of life that's deeply ingrained in their culture. And let's not forget about the Belarusian sense of humor. It's subtle, witty, and often served with a side of self-deprecation. This humor, coupled with their hospitality, makes the Belarusians an absolute joy to be around. So, if you're looking for a place where you'll feel like family, Belarus is it. The Belarusians will welcome you with a warm smile, share their rich traditions, and make you laugh with their wit. It's a cultural marvel that will make your journey unforgettable. Have you ever tried Draniki? No? Then you're missing out on a potato lover's dream. Now let's embark on an exciting culinary journey into the heart of Belarusian cuisine. This gastronomic adventure promises to be a feast for the senses that you won't soon forget. Belarusian cuisine is a flavorful blend of simple, hearty fare and sophisticated culinary traditions, making it a treat for both the taste buds and the soul. It's a cuisine that's deeply rooted in the country's rich history and cultural heritage. First up, we have the national dish, draniki. These are mouth-watering potato pancakes that are crispy on the outside while maintaining a soft, almost creamy interior. They're typically served with sour cream and sometimes even garnished with caviar for a touch of luxury. Trust me, once you've had a taste of draniki, you'll be craving for more. Next, we move on to the Belarusian stews, from the hearty machanka, a pork stew served with fluffy pancakes, to the kolduni, meat-filled potato dumplings in a rich broth. These are dishes that warm you from the inside out. They're the kind of meals that remind you of home, even if you're miles away. But let's not forget about the sweet treats. Belarusian pastries are a testament to the country's love for all things sweet. The crowning jewel of Belarusian desserts is undoubtedly the zapekanka, a baked cheesecake that is as rich as it is satisfying. It's the kind of dessert that makes you want to skip the main course altogether and dive straight into the sweets. Belarusian cuisine is a symphony of flavors and textures, a testament to the country's rich cultural heritage. It's a cuisine that is as diverse as the people themselves, offering something for everyone. From the hearty stews to the sweet pastries, every meal is a celebration of Belarusian culture and tradition. In the end, Belarusian cuisine is not just about the food. It's about the people, the traditions, and the shared experiences that bring us all together. So, the next time you're in Belarus, don't just see the sights. Taste them. Experience them. Live them. Just a heads up, you might need to loosen your belt a notch or two. As they say, all good things must come to an end and our Belarusian adventure is no exception. We've journeyed together through the majestic landscapes of Belarus, marveling at the architectural wonders that tell tales of a rich and vibrant past. Each corner we turned, each cobblestone street we meandered, revealed a new facet of this Eastern European gem. Remember the awe-inspiring Belarusian architecture? From the grandeur of Mir Castle, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, to the charming rustic homes in the countryside, Belarus has a way of transporting you back in time. It's as though history has been lovingly preserved, allowing us to experience echoes of epochs gone by. And who could forget the green lungs of Belarus, the Białowieża forest? A verdant oasis that breathes life into the region, it's a testament to the harmonious coexistence of man and nature. A walk through its dense canopy is like a walk through a fairy tale, complete with European bison playing the part of gentle giants. Speaking of giants, let's not overlook the cultural marvel that is the Belarusian people. Their warmth and hospitality have a way of making you feel right at home. The cultural richness, from the traditional music and dance to the colorful festivals, is simply unparalleled. And of course, the gastronomic journey that is the Belarusian cuisine. 
The hearty dishes, the sweet treats, the home-brewed drinks, a feast that tantalizes the senses and warms the soul. So as we bid farewell to Belarus, let's carry with us the memories, the experiences, and the flavors. And if you haven't yet, I encourage you to embark on your own Belarusian adventure. Experience the charm, the history, the nature, and the culture for yourself. So, are you ready to add Belarus to your bucket list? Let us know in the comments below. And remember, the world is a book, and those who do not travel read only one page.